Hello everyone, welcome back to my blind LP of Pokemon Conquest. In this episode we defended uh, Pugilis against the attack from Tura. Um, so, I was just looking over at Hiloso to see what would occur if I wanted to like take on both nations at once, kind of. So I moved Ryan and we two over uh, here. So I could attack them, right? But Ampharo is currently doing anything possible. So I guess if you attack um, one nation, you can't attack the other one, and you have to follow through when attacking the first nation. So be mindful of um, protecting. Be mindful of which nation you're going to attack, so you don't uh, jump the gun and decide against it later. But I guess if you have to take both out anyway, I mean, I don't know. Just be mindful of which nation you're attacking first. Because then you have to execute on that attack and be prepared to attack them. Alright, so now that I uh, transformed, hopefully they will accept me as a worthy rival now. I didn't have any problems in that, in the defensive battle, so... Yes, it is something we build with our own hands. So let's see how this happens now. I think they have a strength advantage on me, but... Ryan, I've been waiting for you. Hmm, you look different. Well, well. I do think this battle's going to be fun, don't you think? Yuki Maru. Most definitely. If Lord Ryan is our opponent, then I shall give it everything I have. Yes, so shall we begin? Ah, now I have a very slight strength advantage after I transform. Ah, I'll show you what I'm made of. Back to that I'll show you attitude, it seems. Okay, so we have a desert... Uh, send. Let's prove how strong we are. So we have a Raptorier. Uh, more banners. Okay, so we need to defend banners again. Okay. That seems to be the case, defending banners. A tower like this in the middle of the desert. Does it surprise you? With all the rock types, no. This tallest building in all Zensai. Even flying Pokemon would struggle to make it up here. Really now? We have to see what my Sarivi has to say about that. You're welcome to try climbing in if you want, but I can't be held responsible for what might happen. Ha uh ha! -huh. Okay, so we have desert, which seems to slow my units down. Yes, my units. This is finding them all over again. Uh. This is the lift, which I guess would take me up there, maybe? And the other lift would take me down? Uh, I don't know. Uh, hmm. Let's see. Um, scraggly. <laughs> Scraggly is on that side, so I'll need to have Timber over here. And also move Saravia over there as well. Time has come, hasn't it? Indeed it has. Eh. Hmm. Okay, so they have those. Alright, let's move. Uh friend pull up over here along with um carnivine and have Eevee in a little bit in the middle all right sure see so, yeah, how this works out for me now where is that rift here you're going to go oh 
Okay, so Charmander's going to go down over there. Everyone's moving that way, which isn't really going to help when my water types are in the back over there. Yeah. Everyone is all on that side. Now, let's move five spaces with the dramatic now. Uh, okay. Um... Let's move Jigglypuff over to get that one banner, I guess. Eevee can... Uh, move out a little bit. Uh, excuse me. Timber can move on onto this grass, I guess. Saravia can. Uh, hmm. Friend of Vine can move out. Uh, Friend Club can also move up. Saravia. Cause I'm gonna need those platforms. Alright, let's move Saravia there as well. Okay. Let's see what happens. Let's give this a whirl! Attack up. Oh boy. Ouch. That did a bit of damage, and now he's up there. So after using the lift, they're now upstairs. Hmm. Okay, so Drillbeer is running for that platform. Alright, so... If they make it down the platforms, then I'd lose, right? I needed to, because I need to defend all three of them. And it's not a five-turn thing. And then there's a sandstorm. Whoa! That... Well, that's lucky. Righto, now we're in full swing! I can't get enough of the thrill of battle! That was... Alright, now, can I move the map a bit? Uh... I guess that's as much as I'm going to get, it seems. 61. What is my ability, warrior ability again? Fortify. Mm. Uh, excuse me. Let's move Trimp up there. Move Jigglypuff over there. Uh. Fire Divine can't reach. Uh, hmm. We could have Timber attack the... If I have Timber attack, I need to get pushed back a space. Okay, and then... Low kick. Super effective. Now... Can I move Eevee and knock him out? Uh, no, I cannot. Uh, Alright. Uh, we get problematic having to adjust to this movement of the problem of, uh, all of, I don't know, the maps and stuff. I could smack the Tepig. And then I'll be on the top. And then I could have Eevee move up a little. Hopefully Sandstorm is sand damage and not rock.
Hmm. He didn't attack me there. Alright, so he's going to dig. But he's also on the platform. Hmm. That's... Ooh. Super effective brain damage. That's not really good. Rock Wrecker? Wow, that's really full range. Even though it wasn't very effective, it did a lot of damage. Oops, this could get nasty. Faint attack. Didn't really do anything. Okay. Uh... Alright, there we go, now I can see better. Uh... Can I just fly down? No, I can't. That's... That's annoying. Um... If I could get damage on the... Yeah, if I could knock out the Scraggly, I would be able to get super effective damage on, uh... Or I could try to kill Tepig. How much does Eevee do? 23? Uh... Alright, let's try to... Knock out the scraggly. And I miss. Awesome. It's final mate all over again. to take him out either, which is just, uh, alright, let's move out some more, have Prinplup move over to take on, you capture the banner, you basically have that Pokemon out of, like, the battle, which isn't really that good. I take out Scraggly that way, but I mean, again, Carnivine would be out of the battle, essentially. Let's move Carnivine a bit away. Okay, so we can't attack twice in a row, and the stupid. Drillbur is on top of the platform now. That isn't very good. But if he can't attack twice in a row, that's nice. That's good news, though. It'll give me less to worry about. Probably gonna need to heal with Jigglypuff, though. Oh, of course you run away. Fingers crossed, Nabracadabra. I don't even know what that did. Uh, okay. A little bit of damage. That pig's gonna... No. Oh. Of course he gets the burn. Amazing. Ugh. No effect. Would've knocked me down, which is awesome. Wow, and the Tep pig's gone. Alright, well... No, I've proven unworthy. Unwo Alright, well. Drover got knocked down, which is good. Uh. Can I knock the. No, I can't. Um.
If I wasn't burned, that'd probably like destroy everything. But I'm burned. Warrior ability, accuracy. Hmm. Uh, do I have anything that cures burn? I don't think I do. Oh, I know you won't. Confused or sleeping? Well, oh, that won't work either. Uh... Alright, so... Let's just have... Timber attack the Rhyhorn, get some damage on it, and knock it into range where I could finish it off with Carnivine. Yeah, okay. Run whip! And there we go. What a fighter, aren't you? I can't hope to compete. Damn straight. I could recover burn if I got onto the banner, couldn't I? I think so. Uh, alright. How much damage can I do with... 96. Alright, well that's gonna happen. Um... How much... 27. Fifty-seven. All right, sure. Try using wing attack. Scraggly's gone, even though Strong Saravia's probably gonna get KO'd really bad. Hmm, I don't know. You don't look like a bad person to work for, I guess. Damn straight. Eevee. I already have that banner, so... Who do I still... Oh, right, yes. Let's use Jigglypuffs. No, no, don't end my turn. Nope, nope, no. Warrior ability. Let's heal my Pokemon. Alright. Now... Jigglypuff can attack the Drillbeer, and it needs to hit at least one. Damn it! It's Bubble Beam time! Haha! -ha. Uh, if she would have hit, I Drillbeer probably would have been dead. But, alas. Warrior villain. No! Significantly increases attack and range. Even though I read that backwards. Oh well. Right, this should help her cause! Now I can knock up the. Yes, knock up. Knock out the Charmander. We have to retreat for now, but next time, victory will be ours. Right, okay. Now I can smack the... Right, fear in the back for no damage at all, honestly. Did I misread the situation? Still, the battle's far from over yet. Okay, so he's not moving anywhere. How about this? Defense up. Alright, so he's just going to run away. Sand pit? Ah, HP up because he's in sand. Okay. That doesn't seem too bad. Alright, I could take out the jewel beer. Yeah, I'm gonna take out the jewel beer. 
bubble beam time! You're quite something. Taking me down takes some doing, you know. Alright, uh... Let's knock the rock barrier over closer to um, my uh, print flop. Have uh, Carnivine capture the flag. Uh, yeah, let's have Jigglypuff capture this banner as well. Well, hopefully, I can. Uh, let's get this item. Power wristband. Uh, I don't really see... Eevee being much use against him anyway, so... I think the banner heals me, doesn't it? Oh! Ow. Well, it does place him in a perfect spot to knock the Rhyperia again. After I like learn how to do stuff. Okay, if I smack him from the side. Hi, thanks, Avast, you're cool. If I knock him to the side, it'll do some damage. Alright. Now. If I... 5 damage... I need to make sure Carnivine can do just enough to knock him out. 43, okay. I probably needed that minimum damage though. Smack, now he's gone. Well, they got us and no mistake. All your enemies have been defeated, now claim all the banners. Alright, well that doesn't really seem like it much of a problem. Since the wind just knocked us down, it shouldn't do it again. And then Primplup can get the item. I get some gold. Okay, cool. Uh, Saravia can get that item, maybe? I think? No. But, whatever. Let's move Saravia over here to get some added people on the, uh... Yeah, okay. Get the freeze block. Uh, okay, whatever. Equipping doesn't really seem that important now. Okay, we got all the items, so let's just claim the last banner then. And there we go. We did it! Victory is ours! And Julie Puff's happy once again. Even though she didn't really do much. Success. It's all strength up. Prevents freezing for three turns. Okay, that sounds good. So I can't recruit the Tepig. I don't so and I don't really care about the Tepig. I uh, can't recruit Charmander, I already have Charmander, so I don't care. I can recruit Scraggly, alright, I can recruit Rhydon. I can recruit the Ground Down guy, that's good. Hmm, <laughs> fine work indeed! You defeated me, Ryan! My deepest apologies. If I adjust, forget it, Yukimaru. Maru. Winning this battle was never my intention. Oh. I was always planning to join young Ryan here. As was I. 
Gasp! Him! So there you are. I thought you might show up. Anyone strong enough to defeat my nemesis is worthy of my service. From now on, I will join your army. Fight for you. Pardon an interruption there. Someone asked me if I wanted ice cream. And since it's hot outside, I guess I'll take ice cream. Okay. And now that we have gained a powerful ally. Wait, two acts. Wait, so I don't face both of them then? This is great news. I was hoping I'd be able to have both of them for experience purposes, but. Click the warriors you wish to recruit. Alright, well, you, Mr. I destroy everything. Mr. 100% link with him. Lightning Rod. Absorbs all electric type moves to raise attack. Ah, uh, so it's not as good as, like, it was in the actual Pokemon games. I thought it would, like, abs Well, it says absorbs all ed ed electric type attacks. So would that mean my own attacks and everything else, or just attacks that hit him? Hmm. Probably need to test that off screen sometime. Scraggly. 90%, okay. Surveillance. Only restores HP of warriors, Pokemon, and adjacent allies for thinking. Okay, so looking at your specialty, it's probably Weavile and Sneevil. And you are just. okay. Cool. Bulldoze. Sandpit. Dig. I don't see why I wouldn't want all of these guys on my team. Yeah, that's to good everyone. Alright. Cool. I'm ready to give it all I've got alongside you. Alright, let's deploy him at Pugilus. Let's move her to Pugilus as well. And let's move him to Pugilus. Let's move Drillbird to Pugilus as well. Shein's army has been defeated and has been forced to retreat. What is happening to Timber? Ooh! He's evolving! And now of Girder. Nice. That's a nice way to finish off the episode. It looks like we're heading for an out war with Nobunaga for control of Ramsai. Indeed, we will face battles more difficult than any we experienced before. Yeah, but before all that, I made us something to all eat. Go ahead and enjoy. Oh, this does look tasty. How considerate of you. Noichi is the... Uh... Awesome girlfriend archetype character, I guess? I don't know. Very well, let us have for yourselves a little feast and celebration, shall we? Alright, Mr. Ground Down Guy, that's large and in charge. Knowing that a showdown with Nobunaga was not far away, Ryan's army resolved to take this fleeting moment to relax and enjoy themselves. You know, Galate looks really awkward there. It. I don't know why, it just looks really awkward. With its face and stuff. Noichi's happy and so is right fear over there. I'm probably pronouncing wrong and someone's gonna yell at me in the comments about it, but... The merriment did not last long, however. Dramatic music. The short lifespan of man is nothing compared to the age of this world. It's but a fleeting dream, an illusion. That's funny, because one of the places you could have got was Illusio. But brother? They're related? Ugh. What is it that you desire? Dot 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 ellipsis. I desire Lord Ryan to find the legendary Pokemon to bring peace to Ransai. Ha! How amusing! 
I should like to see you try and make that wish come true. Defeat my sub subordinates and we shall see. Nobunaga will be waiting for you in Dragnor. And he has Sekrom over there. So, Dragnor, Dragon Kingdom, that nah, makes sense. More ellipsis. Er, 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 Lord Ryan. I'm sorry I didn't say anything before, but Nobunaga is my brother. Why does Nobunaga speak in third person? I don't know. Maybe it's a translation error, or maybe, who knows. Maybe ego? Oh well. That's how I know. That's how I know he's serious. We have to stop him, Lord Ryan. He'll destroy Ramsai if we don't. Jigglypuff's sad. How can you ever accept such a sad Jigglypuff? And then she's pissed off again! Nothing new here. You can't let this happen. That's why I decided to join you, Lord Ryan. I know it's going to be tough, but we must battle against the warlords of Nobunaga's army. We'll start with Avia, Vespia, Kragspar, and Yaksa. We can proceed no further until we're able to conquer those four kingdoms. I know I'm not strong, Lord Ryan, but I will give it my all for this cause. Yeah, you're telling me Jigglypuff's useless. Can, can I evolve Jigglypuff? Hopefully, and like, I mean, Double Slap's really bad now. It never hits. I mean, Oichi's awesome as like a character, and your sweet song ability is really nice for healing, but Jigglypuff itself isn't really up to par anymore. Alright, so we have Craigspore, which has rock types everywhere. So, basically, my team for here again? <laughs> Ah, so I have Gallade as well, but not any of his allies. I see, so you either have the option to choose his allies along with him and then end up getting um, Rhyperior or his guys and stuff. Okay, well that makes sense, I guess. Let's advance next month. October, year three. You're now able to challenge the warlords of Yuvia, Vesphira, Kragsvor, and Yaksa to battle. Alright, well... Tim, uh, Gerd is gonna be really helpful with added attack and stuff. Uh, there's the Dark Kingdom, it seems. With Zorak, uh, that one uh, Sand Dark Gator guy, um, Pawn, whatever it's called. There's then there's the higher Scraggly, Scraggly, whatever it is. Hmm. Here's the Poison Kingdom. Yeah, I'm probably going to end up fighting Craig's for next. It just makes the most sense. Then there's also the Flying Nation over here, which... I know who I'll be using for that! Where are you? There we are. You with your Luxio. He's going to be awesome for the Flying Nation. And... Hmm. Yeah. Guess next time I'll probably off screen train a little bit and then next episode we'll take on Christborn. So thanks you thank all of you for watching. This was a longer episode because more storyline happened, but hopefully you guys don't mind watching this long. And thanks for watching again and take care everybody. Peace.